Hello and welcome back to the tutorial. In this video, I want to introduce the ggplot command included in the tidyverse library. So first, I'm going to again load the tidyverse library and I've already loaded the data sets that we have already seen uh, in a previous video from our GitHub page. Again, you can find the link to this file in the data visualization section of our website. So what is ggplot? ggplot is a graphics library that facilitates visualization of our data. It has its own grammar, its own logic of how a plot is composed, which I am going to introduce. First of all, we always call the ggplot command and pass it our data set. If we just run this, a blank canvas is created in this plot section, as you can see here. We have not specified which variables we want and how we want them to be visualized. So therefore, we will just create a blank canvas. We add layers to the canvas by adding a plus at the end of a line of a ggplot command, and then the type of plot we want. So in this, in this case, it is a line plot, which is called geom line in ggplot. And then we add the aesthetics of the plot, which tell the plot how the data should be arranged. So in this case, we just add the X and the Y axis of the plot. And we want the advertising spending to be on the X axis and the sales on the Y axis. If we have a look at this, we can see that this adds this line plot to the plot as well as the appropriate axis labeling and naming. Aesthetics do not have to have to be passed to the type of plot necessarily, but can also be passed when we call the ggplot command. In this case, this does not make any difference since we're just adding a single layer on top of our data, but we could also add another layer with a different kind of uh, plot type, for example, geom point, and it will also automatically know that these are the aesthetics we want. And as you can see, we have now added those points to our plot, with which previously was only the line. I will introduce a few more layers in the next couple of videos, so stay tuned. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon.